the scenic cement into this uh, spray bottle. Spray bottle. I'm gonna shake this out. And some of the grass. If you're wondering what the uh, plastic bags are, I just use some wire bags just to like mask off the track. That way, I don't get any of the cement or the grass particles on the track. And it's gonna make my life easier in the long run, so I don't have to clear up, clean off the track. Uh, I thought it was a kind of. Uh, a lot of people do this with tape, but I just thought, whatever, I'll just do it with plastic bags since I had those laying around from wires. Uh, I uh, got done with the uh, Woodland Scenics Grass Vine Turf and the Woodland Scenics uh, ugh, uh, Scenic Cement. I still have some of the Scenic Cement left. I did like the whole inside of the oval. Just got to do the outside. I did run out of the turf. And it looks pretty decent. I'm probably going to go over it, get another uh, thing of turf. And yeah, uh, it came out actually better than I expected. I'm really glad that I went with a green foam under, uh, a green foam underneath. That way, uh, it looks pretty good in the areas where the, there's not a lot of grass. You can, it still doesn't look too bad. Like right there, for example. Still doesn't look that bad. Uh, except I should have done, I should have... <laughs> When I put down the foam, I should have just put it like all the green side up. So now I got this Lowe's thing right here. I'll uh, probably get some of like the, uh, probably, I'm probably going to end up getting some of like the sh grass, uh, paper grass and putting that over there. But yeah, it turned out pretty good. Today is November 11th, 11, 11, 18. Yeah, that's the date. Uh, I sort of messed up on the grass I, uh, when I... Put the scenic cement in. I put I diluted it a little, a little too much with water, so a lot of it didn't stick. We swept some of it up and put it back in. I think one of these bottles. Uh, yeah, so I'm, just, I'm gonna put some of it down. This is the stuff that that stuck, but I'm gonna uh, uh, put some more down. Use a little bit, uh, a lot more. Uh, got some more glue, and uh, I got some. I also got some. Got some more uh, the cement. I got last time I only got fine grain. This time I also got some coarse, coarse turf. And this is this is the new bottle here. This is the stuff that we just put back. I think I forget. But uh, yep, I got some more scenic cement. So we're gonna hopefully do this. I'm gonna. Try to do a time lapse of it because that'd be pretty cool. So yeah. uh, I ripped up the track too to make this a bit easier. That way I can just, you know, not have to worry about masking off the track. And yeah, I'm gonna put the grass down. Hopefully this goes good. I'm not really, I'm just gonna put, put the uh, fine stuff down first. Then I'll put the uh, coarse stuff on to create like uh, heavier areas of bush. But yeah. Got most of the uh, stuff done as you saw in the time lapse. I'm probably gonna stop the time lapse here because so this doesn't get incredibly boring. But looks pretty good. I'm just gonna finish up, get some of the uh, areas that are kind of you know spotty down here. Looks pretty good. Uh, I really messed up when I put the foam on. I put this lows the low side up. Uh, so I'm gonna definitely go a lot heavier with the turf right here. I'm probably going to end up needing a new bottle of the cement, but yeah, it turned out pretty good.